Hey, hi, hello. How's it going? Welcome back to Two Dumb Dads. I'm Chris, and this is Filling Out the Journal, the series where I strive. Whoa, what's going on here? Ah, everything's getting wonky. Oh man, I really hope this is working. I also kind of hope this isn't going out to, every to everybody. It is. Oh no, it is. Are we good? Are we good? I think we're good. Alright, well, I have put in a little bit of work here to figure out what we're missing in this journal. And essentially, it seems to equate to a whole lot of stuff that is either contingent on a lucky map or effectively making it to the end of the game the hard way. So today, with the exception of the couple of the easy things that I've seen a million times and apparently just never actually picked up, I'm primarily just going to focus on beating the game the hard way. So I don't know, maybe I'm going to put in a little bit of extra effort to do it. Maybe I'm going to luck into it. Maybe absolutely none of the above will happen. And I'll have another episode where we make absolutely no progress. But hey, as I've said before, that's the way of Spelunky. Sometimes absolutely nothing good happens. You feel like crap. And you still somehow have a wonderful time doing it. Hope you're having a wonderful time watching me do it because, well, I'm still here. Uh, there's no rock. I'm just going to go ahead and get out of here. Really, there's no rock. There's no nothing. I should have gone over and gotten that worm. Or that worm. The mouse? No, not the mouse. Yeah, the mouse. We're in the caves. It's a mouse. Anyway. So. Let's see if the, uh... Nope, it's not here. So I think there's only a couple of weapons that we're still missing. I think the uh, proper term here is items. Yeah, items. We're missing these two, which both come from the same enemy. And then we're missing these two. One of which is really easy to get, the other one is rather difficult. Um, if we get there, maybe I'll try getting the rather difficult one. But only if it's kind of in the, uh, the realm of ease. If... Oh crap. Come on, come on. Man. Well, this isn't starting off great, is it? Yep. Uh, uh. Alright. Well. Jesus, I'm only at 200. Well, there's the puppy. He'll. It'll protect me. Don't need to gender the puppy already. Oh, man. Anything down there to worry about? Yes, so I'm not going to let you go down there alone. How about here? Yes, I'm not going to let you go down there alone. Oh, this is nice and easy too. And there we are. Um, there we go. Boop, boop, boop. Ah, uh, no reason to worry about that. So the reason why I've been missing a couple of these uh, items, aside from just having lousy runs the last few days, is that I never, ever try for the stuff that I'm missing, because... I mean, between not being all that helpful... Ooh, that was close. It's also just, I don't know, 
Like, I always think of everything as a cost reward. And most of the stuff that you have to get, or that's left to get, the cost of getting it is just so much higher. Like, the risk reward, however you want to look at it. Like, if I miss it by just a little bit, it's going to cost me a whole lot more than the benefit I get from getting it. Mmm, yeah. It's down there. Alright. So for you, I'm gonna try and take this with me. So I can arrow that take you out that way and now hopefully I just blow that up enough that I can get through there we go now the real question is whether or not it's worth it to use one of my bombs to get up there there is a box so it could be a three for one situation or it could just be another I'm going to have to use a rope, too. Let's see what I get. Ropes. Well, I had enough bombs that it was worth it. I should take something with me, just in case. You never know when you're going to get stuck, surrounded by arrows, having to sacrifice lives. So I always like to carry something. Well, I guess this is a situation where I do know I'm not going to get... Oh, son of a... Well... Let's do another run. Let's do another warm-up run. I've been having some bad runs, so let's, let's do two warm-up runs today. Especially if I'm theoretically trying to beat it the hard way. Actually, there's no theoretical about it. Today, I'm trying to beat it the hard way. I've been sick for a few days, as those of you who have been uh, watching our Last of Us stream will attest. I've been a little sick, and so like this is the first day I'm really starting to feel good again. I still have a little bit of a cough, but like, I feel strong. I feel like this is the day. This is the day when I can be on mic all day, get some recording done, and really, really get it, get into it. But that means I gotta do a little bit of extra warming up, because I've been, haven't been putting in my hours. Haven't been, uh, getting my miles in, as my, my old neighbor used to say had a neighbor who was an ultra marathon runner. Guy did a race, I can't remember the name of it, but he ran across the state of Tennessee the long way. He said, I remember uh, as he was finishing up, he had a, he wrote a post that said, oh, just two more marathons to go. I think I was too nice, but all I could think was like, yeah, I've, I've been eating Pringles all day. Only two more chips to go. Nope, still not there. Okay. All right. Uh, this feels, this run feels better. I don't particularly know why it feels better, but it does. I should say, while I was checking to make sure I knew which things I was missing, I saw a couple YouTube videos. You know, things that come up when you Google stuff. And they both said, um, like speed runs of basically what I'm doing. And apparently if you're good at this game, which apparently I'm not. I thought I was good at this game, but apparently I'm not that good at this game. 
Apparently you can get all journal entries. Oh shit. Well, on the bright side, I got all the stuff. Oh, hey. Well, I'm not going to say it was worth it to piss off the, the shopkeeper already. Now let's see if I can get a lucky bounce. I doubt it. But I might be able to get him to go down. Oh, well, that's not going to help any. Alright, well, maybe I can... Oh, of course it is. Man, this is... not going as well as I was hoping it would. <sighs> Last try. There we go. I hope. Yeah, okay, I can still get this. Alright, well, this was feeling like a good run. It no longer feels that way. This is now starting to feel like a run that will be over in a matter of seconds. I have no bombs. I have a shopkeeper chasing me. Although hopefully this way I can take out the shopkeeper. chance I took him out? Nope. <laughs> Run! Alright, and I'm running. Alright, well, that wasn't ideal, but hey. You never know, maybe I'll... Maybe... Oh shit. Man! Take that. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's it. We're doing another one. We are. We are going to have at least one respectable warm-up run. Oh, I'm here. Have I used that? Yes, I have. I hate this thing. If you're wondering what it does, it basically lets you hover. You can turn it on and off. I probably picked this up in like my first run or two because I hate it so freaking much. Because what inevitably happens is I'm like planning a jump and then the hover kicks on on accident and I miss my jump and I end up landing on a spike or something. In my head, I still have my rocket pack too, which is the worst part. It's the worst part about getting the rocket pack and then having your run in prematurely. Because it feels like you still have it, but you don't. Yeah, like right there, I was thinking, oh, I'll just fly up and get that bat real quick. But I don't have it, so I can't. But I still tried, so I got hit. Like a doofus. Wee. It is fun to hover long distances, though. I'll be honest. Alright. Anything good? I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to grab this arrow. There we go. See, if I tried and swung it there, I probably would have just hit the stupid uh, spider and then fallen straight onto those spikes. And I didn't feel like doing that. It did not feel like the way I wanted this particular run to end. Oh man. sip some coffee. Ah, awful. I bought some coffee from uh, from the local fairway. Oh, son of a... 
Yep, that was my bad. That was just a stupid move. Anyway, I bought the coffee. Because it said it was uh, New Orleans style coffee. I was like, hey, I like coffee and chicory. I'll get some coffee and chicory. You know what it wasn't? Coffee and chicory. I honestly couldn't tell you what it was. I can tell you that it did not taste like coffee and chicory. It tastes like coffee and crap. If I'm being honest, it kind of tastes like French roast. Like somebody decided, eh. Coffee and chicory is smoky. So rather than actually like investing and in mixing the, the ingredients properly and making a good roast, we're just gonna, I don't know, we're just gonna not. And subsequently, it's poop coffee. So I went to my nice little local place and got a pound of pound of their stuff. But I feel guilty just wasting coffee. Even bad coffee, even like off like even if it's just Folgers. Like coffee that like you can buy by the 30 pounds for five dollars. Actually no, that doesn't exist. Coffee is way too expensive. But even like the expensive coffee, I still feel, or like the cheap coffee, I feel bad wasting it. I'm like, ugh, I know, I know there's somebody out there in the world who's under caffeinated and could desperately use this. And here I am just wasting it. Point is, I'm drinking crappy coffee. That's really it. That's the only moral of the story at the moment. Oh man. That's right, I just won't get that one. Ah, stupid, stupid, stupid. Do I already, yeah, I already have the Eye of Osiris. I don't really have to look out for anything special. Alright, come on. Come and get me. Ooh, glove. I'm gonna get that glove. Hello? Oh, did I just get I did, I got hit again. Man, I hate these stupid mm. I hate these dark levels. Like I think conceptually they're fun. Like as a level in a video game, I think it's really cool. As a thing for me to do when I'm trying to beat the game, it sucks. And when you get them in hell, it's- oh my god, when you get them back to back, it's awful. Wait, how did that go out? How did that go- oh, because that's the one I- I brought from the last level. Alright, I have that, I have that, I have plenty of bombs. I don't have a lot of bombs, but I have enough bombs. Mm -hmm. All right, I know I could go to the worm here, but there's really no need to go to the worm, so I'm not going to. Oh, wait, what was I trying to do here? Ooh, I can fill out something in the journal here. So I'm gonna. Although I have to be honest with you, it is probably going to cost me this run. But I have been waiting for this stupid map for so long that I kind of feel obligated to try. Oh, I thought I had the... I mean, I have to take some kind of weapon. No, I don't really want that as my weapon. Do I have a... I don't. I don't know where I could get the... 
Where's the stupid... Can I get lucky just throwing it down there? No. Alright, so... If you keep your eyes out... You may see... A giant piranha. Oh my god! That sucks. Here, it'll probably show up here just while we're sitting around. While I'm floating. There we go. Oh, hey. See, that right there is what I need to get. But apparently, you can only get him on those maps. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do our daily. And we're going to keep on trying all this stuff. The same usual... Same stuff we've been doing. I'm going to try and get the the in the hard way. Hopefully it actually works. I don't remember PD Piranha. I think that's the, the name of the of the, the big piranha. It's PD Piranha or something like that. Regardless, point is I don't remember him actually being that hard to get. I just remember I got him on accident just from probably falling in the water right on his head and being nibbled to death. Although really, I don't think it should be called nibble to death when you get eaten by that one. It should be gobbled up. Or like devoured. Or like, holy shit, Jaws is real. Mm. I don't feel like wasting a rope on a, on a puppy right now. Because this one's for real, you guys. Oh man, are you kidding me? Well, I shouldn't die in the caves. Well, I kind of feel like there's going to be a... There we go. Jump. Got it. Jump. Got it. Shit. He didn't get me. Um. Please don't. Okay, good. I could just see that thing getting pissed off at me and deciding he wanted me dead. Jump. I dare you. Actually, I don't dare. I really would prefer you not kill me. There we go. Man, I am totally gonna die to this stupid thing. Please don't let a stupid spider kill in my run. There's a lot of dumb things that can end my run, and I'll understand. But dying from a stupid spider, that's. that's just embarrassing. Alright. Oh, son of a... That's it. Well, I think we got absolutely nothing this time. You know what? No, we're not done. We are not done. I am getting something this time around. We are going to find at least one freaking thing in the journal today. This will not be a third episode in a row where I find nothing. Even if that is the way this game tends to go. <laughs> I'm getting something done. Dang it. Alright. Maybe I'll just have like a missing weapon in a box somewhere. I think that's how I found the one of the missing items. The first time I played, I found it. Was it was just kind of somewhere? It was just oh man, I could have used a rope instead. Oh well. I think it just showed up in a box. What really sucks is I think just about everything we have left to get, with the exception of one item is found in the ice caves or later. 
So if I'm having bad run after bad run, we're just never gonna find this stuff. God, stupid son of a... I don't care. Like I said, we are not going to end the stream. Until I find a freaking item in the journal. Just one. I need. One. I just want to find one item. I don't care which one it is. Nope. Missing item isn't in here. I was gonna buy those, but I couldn't. Come on, missing item. and get me oh seriously thank you mm. there we go man this is I think it's getting in my head Dead. I just want to get to the ice caves. I'll even take the black market because I'm pretty sure the stupid thing will be in the black market. Is it here? That's not even a rare item that I'm missing. Well, I mean, a couple of them are rare items. The one I'm currently looking for, you find it just about every time through the ice caves. You find it in a lot of shops. So it's not like it's a rare item. Come on. Oh man, you're gonna totally miss it, aren't you? Just hop up, hop up, hop up, hop up. Yeah, there we go. Get that money. Um, I felt like I threw something over there, but I, I don't want to risk it. <sighs> Alright. Uh, let's see what's over here first before I deal with that guy. Nothing. Alright, let's go deal with that guy. Pew! Um, oh, shit. There we go. Here, could you just... Yeah, thank you. It's not very often I say thank you to a cobra, but thank you. Uh, was there a... No, I think that was on the last map. There wasn't a yellow skull on this map, was there? Oh, no, nope, there's a giant spider. I forgot about him already. Hey, cool. Oh, hey. Completely forgot that was there. I noticed it before. I just forgot about it. Oh good. I was really worried that I just missed it already. Bonk. Ah, screw it. No, actually I can't say screw it. I have to grab something first. There, screw it. I'm out. Mounty 500. 
5,000? Guys, I'm not even like hip for my actual age. Alright, so if I can find an altar now, I can get one of the things and we can be done with this. Bong bong. Such a good sound. I hear a lot of water. I hope this isn't another water map because I really don't feel like trying to find PD Piranha, whatever his name is. Because I feel obligated if I do see that. But I really don't want to. Alright, there we go, there we go, there we go. Bong, there we go. Hi. Bonk. There's nothing over there. Alright, is there a rock or anything I can use to throw? Here we go. I wonder if that skull would work. I mean, I bet it wouldn't. I just have a feeling... Mmm... No. Not gonna... I'm not gonna waste a bomb. Actually, yes I am, because I just noticed how much life I have. So even if I don't get a... Oh god, that felt bad. I felt like I was going to die. I just realized I should really go look around the rest of this map a little bit just to make sure... The black market isn't anywhere here. So where is the most convenient spot to... Oh, probably there. Boom! I feel like I'd be clicking by now if I was. Boom! Am I wasting bombs? I kind of feel like I'm wasting bombs now. Maybe I'll just... Well, there are no bombs there. There's no reason to... I was thinking maybe I'll just go ahead and go after the... Go after the shopkeeper there. Screw you. All right. So then presumably that means there is... Yep, I mean here. It's somewhere nearby. Oh man, it's gonna be in the... I think it's right there under the tree. Yep. Alright, now I have the... Jo oh, well, I have to... Let's buy you... Bonk. Let's go ahead and sacrifice that for the chalice. Go ahead and kill some stuff, see if I can get some life. Bonk. Bonk. Anything up there? No. Be nice to go in there with a shotgun. No, I guess that doesn't happen though, because there's no demon or whatever. I need an ash tombstone for that to work. I can at least stop on this one's head. Things are always money when you want them to be a creature, and they're always a creature when you want them to be money. There we go. 
All right, black market, here I come. So there's one item I'm looking for. I think if I just pick it up, I should. Oh, son of a... Urgh. I'd really like to have at least one more life before I start killing everything. I also don't really want to start the gunfight before I have to. So I'll get lots of bombs there, that's good. Get a rocket pack if I survive this, that's always nice. Now the question is, how do I want to play this? I don't want to go to the bottom and wait. Shoot! 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 I'm gonna go back this way. Um. Alright, well, let's just use up all my bombs here. No, that's not gonna work. Hey, it did. Uh, of course, now I have another problem. go down? Okay, they did go down good. Okay, well that's gonna solve a handful of my problems. That solves some of them. Alright, so far so good. Well, that, that wasn't great. Sure, somebody dropped me. Yep, there we go. Alright. I mean, what am I going to really get there that I don't already have? How about over here? Anything good there? Nope. Alright, so now what I have to do is... Oh, that's not great. Can I get you down there? Nope. Oh, son of a... Guys, I just don't think it's meant to happen today. Alright, I think I've talked about this for quite a while. Let's show you what it does. See, that's really the only good thing about the camera. Is it gets them to stand still and pose. It's adorable. It's just absolutely freaking adorable. good solution for how to get out of here other than give it my best shot and run. Yep, see that's what I was trying to do last time when I got shot in the face. Hello, I'm Tunnel Man. I was taking a shortcut, but there are a lot of monsters down there. I see you brought a shotgun. Can I have it? <laughs> Son of a... Yeah, just take my fucking shotgun. <laughs> I don't need it. It's not like I pissed off anybody along the way. Alright, well, there's still a few things I can get. Maybe I'll get lucky. Find a couple of those items. I will say the big ones, the hard ones, they're not going to happen today. We're not going to add Yama to the journal. We're not going to... We're not going to get the two other hell items. Oh, hey, that's right. I already forgot about that. But there are a couple new weapons that maybe I can get. A couple new enemies that I might be able to get to if I can get to the, to the temple. Nope. Alright. 
right, well. That, mm, I'll use this, because, you know, why not? Huh. I actually didn't know that would work. Camera is one of those dumb items. But like, I know it has use. I know there's utility to it. I've never actually seen it. That's not true. I, I showed it to you earlier this this run. I guess I just don't care about the utility of it. Maybe that's a more accurate way of phrasing it. still haven't gotten anything new which really sucks for the record no matter what even if I don't get something new this is the last the last run I have a bit too much I have to record after this but I'm optimistic I feel good I feel like I'm in a good place seven lives There shouldn't be anything that can kill me except for stupidity. Like that. Like that fucking stupidity. Guys, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you bearing with me while I try to get through this. This has been a much longer process than I, than I expected. Um, as always, you can find me at Chris Moss again. And you can follow us at twodumbdads.com for everything we do. We have a great uh, uh, series, the monthly download that's going on right now, where, where I'm playing through The Last of Us, and we're going to have a talk about it on the podcast here in a couple weeks. So tune in there, um, tune in to everything we do, and until next time, be well.